Greetings fellow 50p collectors, Coin Snatcher here. So back after what seems to be an eternity of no coins arriving and they've all arrived today. So the Royal Mail must have decided it was time to deliver a few parcels, bless them. And they've been out in the rain, the snow and all the rest of it delivering mail. So importantly, we've got a few coins to show. I was going to do them all in one video, but due to the arrival of one coin, I've decided to do a couple of separate videos. So this is the first one for this evening. So we have in front of us the Isle of Man Christmas 50p collection. For anybody who watches my videos, you'll know that I have been aiming to collect as many of the different die marks as well as each year on these coins. So the particular coin that has the most die marks is the 1980 coin. And this is quite familiar. If you have a look on eBay, you'll see plenty of these on eBay. What is a little bit different about these coins is the variety of different die marks you can find. So for instance, you'll see here that we're missing an AE die mark, but there's various different die marks. And if I zoom in, you can just see the die mark over to the left-hand side of the man standing behind the back of the carriage. And this one has a AF die mark. You can just make it out there. So there's plenty of these coins to collect and they come in a <clears throat> uncirculated type format or circulated with A type A type, type die marks and then there's also the proof coins which have a B prefix die mark and then there's a couple of silver proof versions as well with a D or an E die mark on them you just see the E on that one for instance so the particular coin that I was waiting for to arrive and this was posted quite a few weeks ago is a coin which has the die mark on it which is BC so this is a BB die mark coin here and we had a little space ready for the BC die mark coin uh, the coin arrived today and I've got it just beside me here in the packaging it's ready to show you in fact there is the BC die mark coin I think I missed that off so you can just see the BC there behind the bloke at the back of the carriage and what I found out with this die mark is that there's two variations at least of the BC die mark so I was on eBay hunting about as I normally do and came across another version of the BC die mark. So only having one of these at the minute, I thought, well, I'll buy the BC die mark. But when I looked at the coin, the die mark on it looked a bit strange. <clears throat> so I went ahead and paid the money and ordered it because I knew it was definitely different to the BC die mark coin that I have already. And this is the coin that arrived today. So we can see it's got a lovely proof finish on it. It comes in the standard 1980 Christmas card presentation. But I was very, very surprised when this coin arrived because as soon as I looked at it, I could see that there was something unusual with this die mark. So if we have a little zoom in on it, it looks like a BB die mark. But when you actually get in close to it, and I'll hold this as steady as I can, it's a BE die mark coin. Now, I wasn't aware that there was a BE die mark coin, so this was certainly news to me. If I zoom in a little bit closer, let's see if we can get right in on this. Just for anybody who thinks it might be a BB die mark. But this is like eight times magnification. But there we go. So it's quite clearly not. BB die mark it's definitely a BE die mark so I was expecting a second variation of the BC die mark coin and what actually arrived was this one so what a result uh, in a way it's another cock up from an eBay seller because they advertise the coin as BC die mark and in my opinion the BE die mark must be considerably rarer than than the BC die mark and if we have a little look over in the book here we can see that there's a BC listed but there's no BD which exists and there's no BE which exists and 
there. Oh, that's the 1981 coin. Apologies. If we go up there, we go. So we've got BB, we've got BC, and then we've got D and E. But there's uh, no BD Dimark coin, which does exist. And there's no BE Dimark coin, which, <clears throat> as we now know from finding this beauty of a coin, does exist as well. So a proper result today. In a way, I'm not too disappointed not to get the second variation of the BC Dimark because given the choice of the two, I would have rather had the BE Dimark any day of the week. So I just need to uh, make a few adjustments to the tray here and shunt a few coins over. That was where the BC coin was going to go. So we'll have to move that and we'll have to get a well we'll have bc up here so it'll be bc and then the be one will go in here and then we're on to i think these are the d and the e silver proof coins so there we go an absolute result today getting a be dimark coin super happy with that as with all the videos leave a comment below hit the like button subscribe to the channel but for this video that's it for now peace and love coins not your right